Well, hello, everybody. Happy Easter. Come on in. Have a seat. We're going to celebrate Easter. Uh, me and Kevin want to wish everybody a happy Easter. And if you listen, you'll be able to hear him play the piano. So when he starts playing, I'm going to stop talking and I'm just going to crochet while he plays as a gift to you guys for the holiday, especially those of you that are all by yourself. Hopefully this will bring a little bit of Easter joy to you and we'll go from there. I don't know how long he'll play, but he'll play until he's done, I guess. <laughs> Right? We'll enjoy it while he plays. So, as soon as he starts playing, I'm going to stop yapping. And I hope you all have a blessed day.
wasn't that just fabulous? I'm so happy. I love hearing him play the piano. And that was our little gift to you guys for Easter. Oh, I hope you guys had a wonderful day. It's been a rainy one here. I mean, really rainy. <sighs> you know, you know, um, Tippy, she had to make her appearance. That's, <laughs> that's Tippy. <laughs> and I was shocked that Mama, Grandma, Sweet Pea, well, Sweet Pea is Tippy's mother, but grandmother to all the others. And I was shocked that she actually wanted, and then of course she wanted to sit right here, right in front of the camera. <laughs> Didn't want to move. I apologize, everybody. But them's the fur babies. They want their loving and attention too. And I'm just sitting here crocheting away on my blanket. I've got two colors left. These are the last two. And then I'm going to have to... I thought about doing 40 more, but I don't... Because it's taken about five, it's taken about five mini hanks to get around. So 50, 50 more would give me 10 rows. And that's not 10. That is only maybe three inches. You, you got to remember when you're using sock yarn, it takes a lot to make something. Um, what, Rudy? What, honey? What? Come here, baby boy. Come here, sweetie. What's wrong, baby boy? Hmm? What's wrong? You can't find nobody? There's grandma. Did you all have a wonderful Easter? I'm trying to put something together for my 2,000 um, subscribers. Uh, it's just hard getting everybody together so it might be just one of those I go it alone which ain't so bad and in case every anybody has missed it I'm going to show this picture again this is my sock with all of my stitch markers. <laughs> that was a crazy time. That was just, that was a crazy time. But I've got um, eggs to put together. for co-workers. But I wanted to get a video going for Easter. Because I wanted to make sure I had um, a video for Easter. And then I might even have Another little surprise. 
later on. We'll just have to wait and see how it pans out. Oh, come on. The kids got a hold of my yarn, so it's kind of miscombobulated. We'll get it. We will get it. This takes this takes some time. There we go. And I'm using my yarn bowl. A gift that I got from Aberdeen Wool. I love that thing. And I'm staying away from yarn sales. I'm being good. Although, if I can't find some yarn, I'm going to have to buy it. I'm hoping that me and Kevin can find it. But I am just... Relaxing, doing some crochet. Um, might do some knitting later on Kevin's scarf. But I'm just, I'm a little tired today. I don't think I slept all that well yesterday. It was kind of like my, my sleep was like split. Because I went to bed early. Um, and I slept for like three hours. Then I got up and was up for a while. Then I went back to bed. And I think I slept for like four hours. So, yeah, the kids have got this all knotted up. But it's all right. We'll make it. We'll get through it. One way or another. If I can get my crochet hook to cooperate. Ugh. There was, I don't remember who it was, but somebody was asking me about my little cheap, I mean, dirt cheap folding scissors because I lose folding scissors all the time. It was a long time. I didn't even have folding scissors. I'm, I'm, we're talking like years. I didn't have folding scissors because I would always lose them. And if you get a good pair, they're not cheap. Well, I scoured and scoured and scoured the internet. And I found these. And does it matter what happens to them? Because they're not worth nothing. They work. They cut. It's just... They are... They are what they are. And if they get lost or stolen or if you come across a, another crafter who doesn't have any scissors, it's like you can give them these and not even, not even think twice because they're not expensive. But to somebody that don't have them, it means everything. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters. Uh, 
And I'm having really, I'm having a hard time with this. But love my babies. Love my baby. They get on my nerves. I won't say they won't. They get underneath my feet. That's, that's the scary part. When they get underneath my feet. Because I don't want to fall. And I don't want to hurt them. And I'm always saying, get out from underneath my feet. And Rudy, he loves to, like, if me and Kevin's standing talking, he likes, to, he likes to come up behind one of us and flop down right behind our feet. And it's not a curl up. It's all sprawled out. So I went to step back, and I, ca I caught his tail and foot, and then I had to do these funky um, yoga moves so I didn't um, hurt him this is so but nothing you can do nothing you can do you just smile and go on about life Hopefully the Easter Bunny came to everybody. The dryer's going off, so if you hear a if you hear a bell, it's just the dryer. We're working at trying to get things um, situated. So that way we don't have so much to do through the week. Kevin's, Kevin's always busy through the week. I'm busy through the week. Not as busy as Kevin. But. <clears throat> anyway. I'm going to end this segment here. I just wanted to hop on. And wish everybody. A happy Easter. And. I know um, several of my subscribers don't have anybody for the holiday. So hopefully my video will make your day. Maybe it won't be so lonely. But you know I love you without a doubt. And I wish you the best. And I will see you in my next video. Okay. Bye.